Guess where we are? In the library. We're so excited. We are back. Um, we still have curbside pickup every day from 10, 10 to noon. noon. Yes. 10 to noon. And then from 1 to 5, you can come into the library. And say hi. Yes, we will love to see your faces. Um, from 1 to 5, you can come into the library. There's only a certain number of people allowed in the building at the, at a time. Um, so we're trying to be as safe as we can. Everyone will be wearing a mask. But you can come in. You can check out books. You can say hi to us. You can pick up a reading log because it is still summer reading. And we are still um, doing summer reading this year. You can still pick up a reading log. And you can earn some really cool books and prizes again this year. So please do that. Um, what else do they need to know? I think that's it. Yeah. Are, are you guys ready for our super fun experiment today and adventure? Today, we are doing an egg and vinegar experiment. That sounds weird, doesn't it? It's kind it of boring, smelly. but it's not. It yes. sounds like it might be smelling. It doesn't smell too bad, though. You get close to it. Vinegar is not awful. <laughs> yeah, so there's only like two ingredients you need eggs and vinegar. So, what you do, you need a glass too. You put your egg in the glass, and then we're going to add vinegar to it. And you just want to cover the top. So it doesn't matter of, how much, as long as it's yeah, covered. As long as it's covered. Okay. That's all. Yep. And then the tricky part is you have to wait like three or four days. Ooh. Yes. And we're going to turn it into a bouncy ball. That's weird, isn't it? It sounds yeah. weird, but fun, and yeah. maybe possibly messy if we do it wrong. Yeah. We will see. So the vinegar eats away and has a chemical reaction to the egg's outer shell. And then it has a membrane around it, and it protects it and makes it a bouncy ball. Cool. So yeah. it, it dissolves the outer shell and the calcium on the outer shell, but it leaves that thin little membrane, right? Yeah. Which is the part that um, if you make, like, Easter eggs or hard-boiled eggs, it's that little clear part that you have to peel off with the shell, it leaves that on. So we're gonna yeah. see if we're gonna see if it works. Yeah. So we started this experiment on Sunday, three days ago, and we can show you the, the eggs in the water. So is that the, the is that the is it yesterday? Okay. So that one's only been in the vinegar for one Ooh, day, right? Yeah. I can feel part I of the shell yeah, part of the shell is still on there. But it also oh, it feels like spongy. So yeah. I'm gonna show you guys at the camera. Also, you have cuts on your. Yeah, that may not feel good. <laughs> All right, so this is yesterday's. You can see it's really foamy. Um, I don't see m like much shell, but let's see. So it's starting to feel a little bit gel-like, but yet there's some hard shell there too. So that was one day. Yeah, it looks like a lot of foamy. Yeah, there is a lot of floaties. My hands don't smell the best. So this is day two, which would have been Monday, right? So it's Wednesday, Monday. Yeah. Ooh. So it is. Ooh, ooh. That's cool. you can see yeah, you can yolk. kind of see the yellow oak yolk, yolk. I said oak yolk inside, and it's. Yeah, the membrane is in the the outer shell is kind of coming off, and it feels kind of like squishy. Cool if, if you, um, oh, this is so weird. I'm kind of afraid yeah. to break it, but I don't think that's quite set yet. Would you say that? I don't know. It's close, but it's still not quite there. not quite there. I'm trying to not. <laughs> So this we did on Sunday. So this one would be, what, four days old? It feels actually like the other one, so I don't know. I'm afraid to bounce. So it's maybe, supposed to turn into a bouncy ball. But this is what it looks it. like. And so it's supposed to take three or four days, but it could maybe need to take longer. We'll, we'll be the experiment and find out today. 
my gosh, you guys, this is so cool <laughs> and so weird. It really is. Under there, it does so, not feel like it. It only it preserves the the membrane, right? But the inside of the egg is still a normal egg, right? True. So if we cut it open, it would be. So should we bounce it and then see and then, what it looks yeah, like? Let's do that. Okay. Okay. Might be messy. I didn't bring up the clothes cover. Let's see. Let's see. Well, we covered the table. Yeah. This is another one of those messy things. I'm gonna let you do it. Oh okay. Yeah. Just mount the light. Okay. I'm so nervous. Oh, oh okay. here's girl. Oh, they are, they're not bottle like it. We're supposed to. Oh, oh that's cool. Yeah, I'm going to the blue out of the way. Yeah, this is so weird. Huh. It feels like a balloon, too. So if you do want a true bouncy ball, I would say you might need to wait, like, five or six days. Mm -hmm. Don't bounce it. Yeah, that's true. Just pass it around because it went slightly. But it <laughs> definitely feels really cool. It feels like rubber. Should we try this one? Uh, yeah, I'll let you try this one. Oh, okay. There you go. I did it too high, I think. I hope you guys can see this. It's bouncing. Just do it lower to the surface, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's so cool. That is really cool. Oh, it's so cute. Let's feel it. Let's just shake it lightly. It's oh, so yeah. Like a joke. Oh, yeah. Okay. That is pretty cool. That is very cool. All right. Well, we hope you have fun with this experiment. And that you don't end up with a broken egg like we have <laughs> before. You know, if you do, just hopefully it's not on purpose. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe it's another good one to try outside when you try it out. Yeah. But um, please, if you do this, share it with us. Take a video, take a picture, post it to our Facebook page, post it in the comments here. We would love to see your bouncy egg experiment. Even if it fails, like our friends, especially if it fails, but it is fun. It's funny. <laughs> but we'd love to see what you guys do with it. Like, experiment with it. I wonder what happens if you add food coloring to vinegar or if you, I don't know. I don't know what else you can do. Experiment. Have fun with it. And then show up. Please share with us. Yeah. And then tomorrow, Thursday, we have three programs. We have an 11 a.m. baby time with Miss Beth, a 4 p.m. mindfulness with Miss Courtney, and 7 p.m. is bedtime stories with Miss Angela. So stay tuned. And remember, we're open from 1 to 5 during the weekday, except for Friday because we'll be closed. So come see us. We'd love to see you guys. We really miss you. And have a good rest of your summer.